that still shares last place with whole lot of fun heading for home. Trumbull has gone on narrowly from Falls Rush in, but here produced a challenge is Arian Power, and Arian Power's quickened up to join Trumbull as they approach the final furlong. Arian Power and Trumbull dueling for the lead inside the last two and a half lengths back to Falls Rush in. Now Dark Company staying on late, but it's all too late as they go for the line. Arian Power just too strong and goes on to beat Trumbull. Dark Company stays for length clear from a pushed along burning sun. They're one and two as they swing in. Now Frau makes his move. He's being brought wide by by Ray Dawson. Gunmaker's got a run through on the inside if good enough, but he's about to be passed by Deftira Lad, who's finishing off strongly. Here's Frau down the centre, has hit the front on the far side. Deftira Lad looks a late threat and then follows at Roxbury back in third and then the fading Burning Sun. But it's Frau in front as they race up towards the line. It's Frau right in the quest, crest of a late wave. He's gone on and won again as they swing off the final bend. Poppy May making a move down the centre of the course with a yellow cap as they head then towards the final furlong and it's Holden Hurst who leads under Owen Walsh. Holden Hurst with the advantage a couple of lengths clear of poppy may who's moved through into second place then oh what a night whose runs flattened out lucifer's making late ground but racing now well inside the final furlong it's holden hurst from the strong finishing poppy may there's half a length between them holden hurst holds on beats poppy may lucifer's miss you pete from susie javier and bebold they're one two and three as they're in line for the judge and then in the pink colors is 500 miles atalanta queen making a run down the center of the course but uh, still it's miss you pete susie javier putting in a strong run now harlequin rosie's bursting out of the pack to give chase in third as they race into the closing stages. Susie Javier being reeled in late on by Harlequin Rose. Harlequin Rose getting up near the line beats Susie Javier running on really well as they head for home and Black Medic is sent on by Luke Morris as they come now towards the final furlong. Grandstand finishes well. New look the far side. Dark Devil and Global Acclamation now making their bids well inside the final furlong. Grandstand Global Acclamation the near side. New look over on the far side. Then Dark Devil just in behind them. Black Medic with with the, the others challenging strongly. Grandstand was well there. New look, close. And then follows What Would You Know, beat by beat by beat. And Kenstone, as they shape up to approach the final furlong. Bell Heather, the one to catch from Tangram. What Would You Know is running on strongly. The green colours, then beat by beat by beat. Down the wide outside, Fitwood Star finishes well, as does Derry Boy. And Fitwood Star defying a long layoff as bursts through from way off the pace. And he's going to win this emphatically. Fitwood Star goes on to win. Fifth based and he'll tap for foot is next. And Kirtling will have to pass them all. Lady Alicia and Muftaka really quickening it up from the front as they swing off the last bend. International Law is let next. Then comes Maddie looking for a way through the red and yellow cap. Then wide on the course is Kirtling coming now towards the final furlong. Lady Alicia and Muftaka but splitting the pair now and leading is Maddie who's been brought through by Murphy to lead inside the final furlong and will draw away as Sheen Murphy doubles up on the night. Muftaka have won three parts of a length away in second and now moving up to challenge heading towards the final furlong. And it's Lord of One who's come through now to take a narrow lead from Galahad Threepwood. They're four lengths clear of Flight Path who disputes third with Irene's Dream. But it's Lord of One now sent clear by Asheen Murphy in the closing stages. And it's quickly forging clear. It's gone five, six lengths clear. And Lord of One will open his account. It's a double for Sir Michael Stout and three for Asheen Murphy on the night. Wallgate running rather green but brought towards the centre of the course. Making ground as Marietti takes over as they approach the final furlong. Marietti from Wallgate. Love, love between the two. Then Rabe finishing off well towards the inside. Wallgate, Love, Love, Marietti, then the, towards the inside, just the edging left as they come now well inside the final furlong. It's Wallgate in front. Love, Love, though, putting in a strong run on the far side. And Love, Love will get there. And it's another on the night for Asheen Murphy. That's four.